Okay, Thomas. Here we are. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look. That looks great. Really nice job. I'll tell you what's bugging me though is the lowercase r. And what's bugging me about the lowercase r is the that uh, uh, vertical stem right there. I, I think it's too high. It resides too high above the, the x height or the mean line. And if we can we can just kind of show you that by taking this, I'm going to use the top of this as a straight edge. But just bring that and we'll place it right above, right by that U. Okay, so we can see that little overshoot here for the the A's, uh, the C's, and a portion of the R, right? But, and that's great, right? But this just sticks up way too high. And that's that, that horizontal stem, I'm sorry, that vertical stem for that lowercase r, I would just reduce that size a little bit. You don't have to bring it all the way down to the mean line, but I would definitely reduce it a little bit. I mean, it just, it seems a little bit imbalanced, um, almost like it's going to tip this way a little bit. So I think by reducing the, the, uh, uh, the top weight on that just a little bit, it's, it's going to even that out a little bit, make, make it look a little bit nicer. Um, yeah, looking really good. Okay, lowercase letters look fantastic really look great here a couple of issues with the other uppercase letters as we can see the x and the y have a much thicker visual weight than the rest of the alphabet so let's go ahead and address those the z and the s i don't think they're working i think they need more work they're just kind of, kind of got that little hiccup right there we can see it here and here and they're just not working they almost seem like they've been rushed to finish the alphabet so let's go ahead and address the s and the Z. And boy, I got to tell you, this cap B, it's cool, but it's just bugging me. I, I don't think it's very versatile. Um, try typesetting this in a word and you'll see what I mean. It looks more like shapes than a letter form, so I would ad address that uppercase B. Lowercase letters look fantastic. Really, really good relationships there. Lowercase Z, lowercase S look fantastic. Um, good consistency there. Okay, one thing we do need that is not included here is we need, you know, we have uppercase and lowercase, but we need a character set too, 0 through 9. We also need punctuation, and that punctuation you need to include a period, question mark, exclamation point, comma, semicolon, colon, apostrophe, and quotation marks. We don't have any of that. So what we're missing here, so make those changes like I've addressed, or at least consider doing so. And then also don't forget to add your uh, uh, numeric character set as well as your uh, punctuation and you can just go ahead and submit that in with your final milestone submission or you can submit it right here if you would like additional comments all right fantastic work if you have any questions please let me know thank you very much